Hey guys, so we're back. Um, it is now Monday, January 18th. Um, February 18th. <laughs> it's February 18th. Um, so we're excited because they've done a lot of visual progress for you guys um, since we last videoed. They framed in all the doorways. Um, so this is the door to the master bedroom. We can walk in here first. They framed and sheetrocked both the doorways into the bathroom and the walk-in closet. So you guys can actually walk in here and kind of, the space is more visualized. Let me plug this light in. but you guys can still see. So this is our master bathroom. Um, they framed out the shelves that are gonna go behind the toilet. So we'll have one, two, three sheetrock shelves before it finishes off to the ceiling. This is our shower. Um, so this is gonna be the door. This is gonna be the door. It's gonna be at an angle um, as to not impede whoever's standing at the sink. Um, but as you can see, it's a good size. Um, let's see. Um, if you want to walk in here to the master closet, let's walk in. There's no light in here. Um, so I don't even know if you can see how big it is, but you can visualize the space more. Um, Coming on into the living room, you can see that they've sheetrocked more underneath the stairs. Um, they took down the furring strips on the fireplace, so I've just got to work a little bit harder to find a paint that's going to match this a little bit better, but I'm really excited about this fireplace. Um, walking into the kitchen, this is what's most exciting because this wall is now finished out. So you can see kind of the definition of space um, going into the kitchen. Um, this is the doorway into the basement that they framed out. Behind you is actually the door that we found at Care Bodies. Um, James and I stripped that last week. It still needs to be sanded, but we're, we're pretty happy with the way it turned out. It looks really good. Um, just gotta get some, gotta get some sanding done. Um, let's see. Window. Oh yeah, they put the window in. Um, this brightens up the space dramatically. Mm -hmm. Um, just by itself instead of having that boarded up. I guess we can go out to the porch. So last week we were working on the porch. We're gonna take this door off and sand it some more. Um, the last week, James and I, James washed while I painted. Um, we took down the rest of, I think we had already taken down the shutters by the time we did the last video, but we cleaned up. I primed this whole wall in the starting part of the ceiling, primed the fireplace. Um, I gotta finish this wall. I didn't finish because they were doing the window last week. Um, and I've been working all weekend, but you can, you can see just by that, how much more it brightens up the space. Um, so I know the last time we shot a video, we'd gone to Lowe's and bought all this stuff for the railing. Yeah. We called an audible. Um, we were sitting down eating lunch last week and realized that sitting in the chair, the railing was going to block the entire view. Um, which, yeah, so you can kind of see, because the railing was going to be up to about right there, and then it was going to have the spindles and everything, so 
we decided that we're going to do stainless steel cable railing instead as to not break up the view as much. So we're going to actually return all of this stuff. Um, I guess the stuff already cut up. Yeah. Hey. We only cut up a little bit. Yeah. Um, so we're going to return all of this stuff and then do the stainless steel cable. Um, all right, we can head upstairs. Upstairs, they have started tiling the guest bath. Yep. You can't walk on it, but they started tiling the tiling guys here, so. Electrical inspection should be sometime this week. Um, when they went up, it took them a little bit longer than what they thought because when they went up in the attic, they realized that there was a lot more issues than what they originally thought. Um, and they ended up rewiring our whole second floor. So, Um, where we said that there wasn't going to be any changes up here. They just, they asked, since they were already re rewiring everything, they were like, you have two ceiling fans up here on the opposite side of the room. Do you want to just center a ceiling fan? So we said, yep. Um, so that's happening now. Um, this window still hasn't been replaced or repaired. But outside, there's been lots of changes, so we're excited to show you guys. All right, so outside, exciting. They've installed our door, um, and it's amazing just going inside and turning off the lights, how much light that lets in. I can't wait until we uncover these doors um, because there's going to be a lot of natural light in our basement, which is cool. They still have to do the siding right here. Um, I don't know if we mentioned to you guys or not that we had decided to put siding on the back of the house because it was just old. I don't know what they call it, some type of board. Um, but we decided to do hardy board because it was a little teeny bit cheaper and you can't even tell that it's not wood from far away. Um, so hardy board has been done to cover up all that black stuff. our way down they've done the trim they've still got to frame out and install the window to the basement apartment bathroom and then they've still got a little bit more to do over here but they finished our we finally have a real basement door yep. instead of this barn door that has been nailed up for the last six yeah. months since we went under contract so this is exciting yeah and i think that's about it um we're excited about the progress we'll shoot another video at the end of this weekend they should be starting on drywall and the bathroom should be done so and hopefully the porch has made some progress too that's on us so we'll see you guys later on in the week